Hello, my lovely YouTubers. Welcome to the channel of the Loquacious One. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone is fine. It is Sunday morning. I just had my coffee, so I decided to do a really quick blog on some of the things that I purchased for my home decor. Alrighty. Excuse me, I'm so sorry. Welcome one and all again to my writer diaries and my new subscribers. Thank you so much. I love the kind words, comments, and support. You really inspire me. This is a hobby for me. It is not a job, but I enjoy doing it because I enjoy looking at your videos and getting inspired and learning something new. As I go through my life's journeys, no matter what stage of life I am on or in, uh, or transition or transformation I'm going through, I always love to do things uh, at a comfort level that far surpass what sometimes the bank account says. So I like being comfortable and I'm going to have whatever it is I feel I need if I can possibly get it through different means, okay? As long as they're legal, okay? So sometimes you have to, you know, fake it till you make it and that's all right. Uh, but you should never live below whatever you feel your standard is. Okay, with that being said, what is the haul today? It is home decor from Dollar Tree and one or two things from perhaps a local store. Just one thing, I believe. Okay, two. I'm sorry. Okay, this is going to start at the back and bring it to the front. First, let me show you these because I set them on top. Dollar Tree has these beautiful wall decals, they're called, I believe, or stickers if you want to, from Main Street. They're peel and stick, and it says, You got this. What it says? Yeah, okay, you got this girl. I had to look at it for a moment because it looks somewhat different, but this is what it looked like. And I thought that was so cute. And it's only on one side. So it's one saying. And this other one, I had to get another one for someone. Uh, it says that stuff. Oh, it starts here. Kindness is free. Sprinkle that stuff everywhere. Again, by Main Street. So Dollar Tree has came out with some new stickers. You're going to want to check those out. I am currently looking for the ones with lemons. I believe I've seen them. I'm not for sure and just didn't grab them, but I can't find them anywhere now. So I don't know if they're currently out, if I've seen them in a previous season to this. Well, anyway, let me continue on to show you what I got. And I know people haul these little uh, wall decor pictures i love them truly and this right here it says if life gives you lemons make lemonade i was out out of town and found this so i grabbed it really quick because i couldn't find this anywhere near me is which what i hate about dollar tree sometimes sometimes when you see beautiful wall art it's hard to find because either people get it really quick or it's gone or never arise at whatever store you're at which is unfortunate but this one says thanks for being part of my journey and i thought this was so cute and epic again you could change out these frames folks so uh some wall art like i says i do not like that they have a some i do but it can accumulate pretty quickly because i have quite a bit of pieces so be careful the good thing about it is it is a dollar and you can always gift it to someone or donate it so that's the great thing it's affordable as well as being fun let me move my little flower piece there it's just been sitting there so ignore it uh next thing i got were these lotion soap dispensers with um, a chrome pump even though they're plastic i like the fact that they're silver and I got this, I guess it's intended for the bathroom or even the kitchen because this one right here you could definitely use in your kitchen. And if you like the farm uh, decor type of decorating, these would be cute for that. But I'm going to do a DIY project. When I finish, I will show you that. And I thought these were just classical. They also have another shape 
um, I have it somewhere. I already used it, but they do have a third shade. But you have to get these when the getting's good because they come in other colors, and I wanted them in this sort of off-white color. So I was fortunate enough to have found those. And I'm going to skip around a little bit. I found this from Family Chef, so you know it is a Family Dollar product, but it's the Mesh Sink Strainer, and it's stainless steel. I thought this was a good quality. I bought two because I needed a replacement for my sink. So that was a good deal for a dollar. And uh, it's kind of timeless in this decor. Sorry, I got distracted. Dollar Tree had these picture frames, two by three by special moments. These you could use as, um, what am I trying to say? To identify your dishes, your food on your banquet table. The, that is really what I use these for because it has an easel on the back. Or do they have it on there? Yeah, the easel's on the back. I didn't see that for a moment. got kind of scared. But I purchased four of them. Uh, I have other styles of them, but this is the cheapest way to use them. To I, I set them up and use them to identify the food. I decorate them, so they can be also used as table markers or what have you. So that I, whenever I see a different one that is classic and really don't look cheap, I tend to grab them. I'm trying to check this one out. Yeah, this will work. I also found this Instant Diva Just Add Wine. It is a bottle stopper. It's cute. So I just got it because it was cute. I also found another one of these. It's by Cooking Concept. It's, it says veggie storage, which it is for. But uh, I like it because you can keep your berries longer in there. Because my berries always get smushy on the bottom. And I love that color. I think it is so pretty. I also had one at one time in red, if you remember that from way back. And I also found this by Best Choice. It's colored 250 toothpicks. I got this at the local grocer in their dollar session, so, section, so I just grabbed that. Because it doesn't help. It doesn't hurt to have these when you're entertaining. It just makes it look more festive than the brown ones because you can't really use the brown ones too much but if I need some toothpicks I'd rather use these colored ones I'm going to get another box because um, this would be good for appetizers and canapes and that sort of thing I should have thought about that okay moving right along I found these magnets and this one has I'm in shape round is a shape and it has donuts. I thought that was cute. This one again with that lemon thing. Life needs more sweet tea and sunshine. And it sort of reminds you of lemon. I thought it was a lemon. But it's just a round yellow. But anyway, it's really cute. I changed my magnets out. Although you shouldn't have magnets on the refrigerator. They say I do. And this one says love at first bite. And you know I love cupcakes. Now we're going to get... To the real nitty gritty. It is the false graph mugs that everyone had. I think just start hauling. I don't know when they were placed out. I'm just not finding them. So I'm going to show you my little collection of false graph mugs. That is the deal alert. As well as these Walmarts. These are from Walmarts. Look at them. Isn't that just gorgeous? And I seen someone that hauled them in yellow. I didn't see yellow, but I'm hoping to find them. But I just purchased two of these. It is such good quality. It's heavy. And I do remember when they were at Walmart. And the label it says right here, distributed by Walmart stores. Mug, tall print, sky blue. And that's what they look for. I grabbed the last two that they had. That's all I found. No, I, I take that back. I take that back. They did have more than these two. I just grabbed two because I'm really hoping to get the yellow. That's what that was. And finally to the false graph. These I'm just going to show you 
what they have. I hauled this one with my initial I high uh a I hauled that previous and I hauled it's fun to be a girl with the gold metallic lips. I hauled that previously so that is not new and start each day with start each day with a grateful heart. I hauled this previous. I'm just showing you this. And there is always hope. That was really pretty. They had a lot of inspirational ones. In my area, um, I looked at Miss Black Gold. She had a ton of the coffee scenes and really uh, diva-like scenes. Hers were really fantabulous. I hope I am able to find those. So I'm going to look out for those. Hopefully I will. But I went to another store and I found this yellow one. It's just really pretty. That says, Inspire. You can see that and it has false graph in there and this one says time for coffee I thought that was cute and this one says with enough caffeine I could rule the world and that is awesome excuse my light for changing I'm filming near window so that is accounting for the fluctuation and that is it that's all I really got this time um, I'm glad I got these sink strainers. It may not mean a lot to you, but finding decent ones and at a good price, uh, that was a good thing for me. So I might go back and get some more of these. These are really nice. I like them better than the ones they have at Dollar Tree. They seem more substantial and seem like they would fit flush. So you can check those out if you need a mesh sink strainer for your kitchen sink i was getting in a flux about that and like i said these are for my diyers very classic shape if you're into that farm decor or whatever this will be for uh, uh decor uh mimicking or duping something i seen at a more affordable at a more well it was higher cost so i'm going to do it at a more affordable price point because i refuse to pay that much for that and i know i can do it for Perhaps less than a couple of bucks, and I will check out the magnets. They had a ton of them, including lots. They had cute ones with the little doggy bones and shapes and paws. Those are awesome. Check those out. Uh, finally, some new um, mini frames or table markers. So you can get these. I found these where they have the um, picture frames but also you can check for table markers in your bridal section they sometimes keep them there and of course they have the berry baskets that's what I call them uh, if you are going to be eating berries you want to keep the moisture away from as long as possible this will extend the life you know and that's about it and I hope you enjoyed the little haul found some inspiration or found something you perhaps didn't see which I probably don't think so. These were new to me. And like I said, the with the mugs, it's um it's an effort. A lot I had a lot of these type with um inspirational sayings, which is good, but I wanted these coffee ones more so because they were cute. Because I'm thinking about gifting these. And I want these. I don't know if I sh I showed you these, they were from Walmart. I want to get the yellow ones. So I need the yellow ones and this. And I want to find some more. I'm trying to put a look together with yellow tableware. And I got an idea going on in my head. And that is that. That That is it. That is all. Excuse me. <clears throat> my throat is a little dry. And other than that, what can I say? Sleeping under that air all night. All right, folks, that's it. That's all I'm out. If you enjoyed this video, please thumbs up. Please tap the notification bell so you'll be regularly notified. Subscribe if you haven't. Share if you're on social media. If you have any questions, cares, comments, or concerns, or links that I might be interested in, please leave them in the box below. And until next time, this is the Loquacious One. Hope everyone is on the mark and checking out the deal of the week. It's these false graph or fisk graph. Some people say that uh, monks. It's the everyday line. And they are dishwasher and Michael Waveable, who I'm having trouble speaking today. Safe. All right. Toodles.